I assumed that was what I had to do. I went to school, I went to university, I got my degree, I got a job, and I got a long-term girlfriend, I got a house, I got a cat. Uh, the cat was the only one of those things that I dearly loved. And um, then I realised, 25 years old, for about four years of my life, I'd done absolutely nothing new for four years. I went to work, I came home, I sat on my sofa-sized bean bags, not one but two, you can see them piled on top of each other. Comfort kills ambition like nothing else. And I just didn't realise that I wasn't actually happy. I was just comfortable, they're not the same thing. Uh, so I was incredibly good at computer games, but I really wasn't um, anything but a massive loser. So when I came to 25 years old, I sat down and actually had the first proper think and talk to myself for several years. And what I realised was, Things weren't going well in my relationship. Uh, I wasn't really that happy even having a house at the age of 25 because it, it felt like I was weighed down. I was living in Swansea in South Wales at the time and the poet Dylan Thomas called Swansea the graveyard of ambition. And uh, it certainly wrapped its noose around my neck. So suddenly I realized that I needed to make a change. I needed to start reprioritizing things in my life. And I, I guess the catching point for that was I was doing a job which was well paid but I was only doing it because I got paid at the end of the month. That was it. And I was spending 45 hours of my week, which is a huge portion of my life if you add that year on year, just doing something that I didn't enjoy purely so I could pay for the house and pay for the girlfriend. So I took the girlfriend to the Alps just to try and repair the remnants of our failing relationship. It didn't work, she left me a week later. But what I did realize was that snowboarding was something not only brand new to me, but something I really wanted to engage with. The feeling of riding down a slope on a board was just magical to me, just a simple shift in weight, and suddenly I was turning direction. It just felt free. So when I got back